J Nation here. We're going to be doing a review on this uh, new hoverboard that I got for Christmas. So, Chris, you can come down here. First, what we're going to start off is the looks and stuff. Yeah, we'll start this fan thing. Nobody likes fans. I mean. Alright, so I think the body of it looks really nice. Um. It, it, it rides smooth. I really do like it. Um, it's got lights right here. Um, on both sides. It's the same on both sides. It's, it's really heavy though. Just like all of them. It, it really is heavy. Um, but when you turn it on, the button is right here. It'll go like that. Oh. That will turn green. Right on. That's how you know it's on. Um, it has uh, Bluetooth speakers, which are right here. This is the under underneath of it. Uh, you got the tires. And really, this is about like how it does and like how it, it's really cool. So it takes two hours. To charge for a full battery. Here, let me turn this TV. All right, there. Back. Okay. Um, it takes two hours to charge for a full battery. It works very well. It rides smooth. That's that's what the lights look like. But it, it's kind of nice because you can detect. It can detect if it's like feet or hands. So like, if I place my hands the wrong way or something, it will start shaking. Um, I'm just gonna get on it really quick. It rides really smooth. It, it feels nice. I like it. It's fast. The top speed is uh, 10 miles per hour. Um, it has an app that you have to download. Oh yeah, this one is called the Jetson V5 for version 5. Um, and you have to download an app, but you can change, like, see what it shakes when it, when it's not feet. It can detect if it's feet or hands. Like right now it's, set, it's feeling that it's feet. But if I place my hands the wrong way. It shakes because it detects it. Um, you put you get an app, and you can you can change the color of these. You can make them any color you want. But right now I have them flashing all colors, so it looks really cool. That's how I have it. I like it this way because it goes through the whole rainbow. Um, but it has like a little GPS in it, system in it, so if like it gets stolen or like. If you lose it, you just go on the app and it'll show you where it is on like a Google map type thing. It's really weird. That's a nice thing though. Um, you can shut it on or off. Like if I had my phone right now, I could shut it off just by a click of a button. Um, I can, um, it has the speedometer. It has the little GPS thing. I can change the lights. The rims look pretty dope. I like them. You. There's that. Um, now I feel like we'll just mess around with it. I mean, I, I, do you think we have anything to cover? No? Alright, we'll just mess around on it now. Alright, so I'm just going to get on here. Just do some spins. It spins very fast. And this is on carpet, too. It rides smooth. It picks up really quick. See, like, it's shaking right now. Because it can kind of tell, like, if my feet aren't on all the way, it'll shake, which is a nice thing. Um, when I, the max speed is 10 miles per hour, and when I hit 10 miles per hour, it'll, like, you, it'll, like, feel like it's pulling you back, because it is. And if you keep going faster, it will shut off and you will fall. So, like, when you're going, it'll kind of, like, pull back, and it'll feel like it's pulling back. So you go back with it, like, you slow down, because in, it's indicating that... You're at the top speed, and you can't go higher speed. So, I mean, I really like it. I'd say 
out of one of a ten, one out of ten, oh gosh, I'd say a nine point five. I, I don't, I, I don't, I can't think of anything that's bad about it. Can you? Mm, no. All right, Chris, you want to give it a shot? Just kind of show them. All righty, I'll take the camera here. Are we able here. to go out there? Or? Uh, I mean, we could. Let me ask my dad. So this is Matt. And he is playing skate through. Wait, how do you hold out again? Like, two cars? I don't know. Jordan only knows that. Dang. Hi, Jordan. He said, no, but how do you hold out two like cars? Uh, it's R1. Yeah. <laughs> Teaching him how to play Skate 3. Yeah, right. Skate 3 on a PS3. Okay, here we go. And start. Wait, it's gotta focus. Stupid camera. Wait one minute. It's gotta focus. Focus. Focus, you dumb thing. Here, I'm just gonna point it at the ground. <clears throat> we'll be back with you guys when it gets focused. Alright, we're back. It's finally focused. It took like 30 seconds. Getting dizzy. Ooh. I'd say the only bad part about it. Alright, Chris, let me see this. Watch. The only bad part is this plastic right here sits so low. Like, literally, my finger. Um, this is a box fan compared to it. This is my hand. If I put it right here. It's just so low, so if you lean too far, for, too far forward, it literally catches the ground. I'd say that's the only bad part. And when but you it, ran over my foot, literally the wheel didn't touch me, the plastic did. Yeah. And the plastic hurt. Because it's pointy. But I'd say on concrete, it's going to be much higher. This is also carpet, so it's sticking up a little bit. But, yeah, that's that. Alright, keep going. Just do some random stuff, where really, whatever. Yeah, like I said, it takes two hours to charge. Um, oh yeah. And right here, right now it's green, which means it's 50 to 100%. And then it'll turn yellow, which is saying it's getting a little dead. And then it'll turn red, which means just get off. It's, it's done. It's time to charge. There's that. You can just keep going. This is the charger. What the heck? Smarties. Um, this is what it looks like. This detaches, and then this is just one box. I think I've seen her music. Yeah, there's that. And then this is the box right here, but it's kind of put away. I mean, yeah, I'd say just like and subscribe on this video. That's all I gotta ask. Right? Yeah. Oh, wait, there's one more thing I gotta do. It's what? The Oh yeah, we gotta do all the butt moves and stuff. Okay. Here, I gotta back up. Go on the bed. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I can't stay still. I'm shaking so bad. Are you ready? Did you see Oh! <gasps> Literally, this hoverboard is so powerful. It moved like a bag of, uh, Salt oh, for like ice. Like literally, it, this thing is so powerful. Yeah. So these are pretty heavy. They're, he's gonna take two, like of these maybe cases of mini bottles. Right, so There's two are, of them. These are maybe 15, 20 pounds, and we're about to put this hoverboard up to it. So. Yeah, that's like 15, maybe 20 pounds. Like it, it's pretty heavy. But let's see if this hoverboard's got a nothing. Those no, I don't know. The hoverboard's got a lot. The fan, and we're not gonna mess with that. Yeah. Let's see if we can take a pile of clothes. Maybe? Nah. Let's see if we can push its own box. Well, obviously it could. Alright, but we're getting on to almost 10 minutes. So I'm gonna wrap that video right here. Alright, ready? Dude. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We're doing one last. Crap. I dropped my camera. <gasps> Oh, I want to see that when I'm editing this video. Alright, so this is like 
maybe 30 pounds. Maybe 50, dude. It's heavy. Yeah, like maybe 40, yeah, 40 pounds. Yeah, this I think is, 40. This is about like 40 pounds. So let's see what this hoverboard's got on it. Maybe it won't do anything, maybe it will. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Dude, no. That's problem. how powerful this thing is. All right, but we're going on to 10 minutes here. So I'm gonna wrap that video right here. Please like and subscribe. No, like <laughs> and subscribe. That's my Matt, friend Matt right here chilling. Chris throwing up the thumbs up button. Smash that like button. Hey, you should give me a shout out. Let's All right, see. shout out at Matt's channel. What's it called? Matt the Gamer. Matt the Gamer. With the Inferno Dragon unlocking. Because there's a bunch of Matt the Gamer. What, okay, so with the Inferno Dragon unlocking. Okay, I'll show you. All right, he's going to show you. With that, <laughs> well, uh, like right there. That's the picture.